What's up, I'm Moana Turtle, and today we're going to take a short break from all the hidden fates and sanity that's going on to open up some of the more of this Dream League set. I did get two boxes. I'm a big fan of this. I feel like it's a it's a new direction that they're moving in, which I'm big uh, big supporter of, which is those character rares. Kind of plays nicely with the release of Pokemon Masters, the new gacha game. And I love the idea of it's not just the GXs that gets like, you know, some new art love. There's commons, uncommons, they just basically take whatever Pokemon and they add a trainer to it and it's like a new rarity, but it's also oh, what the There's also a bunch of them. I think we pulled a good amount of them in our first box. So I was really happy with that. I think the one I want the most, I do want the Flannery Torkoal one and the red and Pikachu. And then the N, uh, I guess I want a bunch of them. Let's see, put these off over here. Just move over here. But uh, yeah, so many cool cards in this set. And uh, so let's get into our first pack. But it's not too late to enter the Hidden Fates giveaway if you have not yet already. All you have to do is look for the giveaway video, uh, which I can put at the end one of those screen things. Uh, and, ooh, Sneasel, this is, oh no, it's Weavile, this is the one. And, is that a wishy washy? But uh, yeah, go to that video, uh, make sure you hit that like button, be a sub if you're not already, and. Leave a comment with hashtag turtle giveaway and you'll be entered Wednesday morning. We will select the winner. I feel like there's been a lot of wheezings, coughings in the tail end of the sun and moon. Whoa, I'm not sure you guys could hear that. <laughs> Sorry about that. Pikachu, very sweet art. Ah, so I want the dawn one. And then Lily. Is that Lily's resolve, I think? I think the card's actually pretty bad. So I hope everyone's having a good day and hope everyone's having a little bit more luck finding the Hidden Fates packs. And this is the really cool Zatu. I believe this attack brings your opponent down to 10 HP. So much potential with that card. Mimikyu is also a pretty good one to potentially finish off those Pokemon if they retreat away. Mimikyu just does, I think, two damage to whatever Pokemon you want for one energy. Alright, I think this is Will, and it's basically you get to call a coin flip. Uh, I think someone said this is Seismitoad, or evolves into Seismitoad or something. Uh, we got a coughing, and ooh, nice! We pulled this again, the Zekrom and Reshiram. I think this is going to be the strongest, the next big tag team that everyone will be running. Like right now, everything is the right with uh, Mew Mewtwo's. And that deck is so strong, but I feel like this one, uh, actually it could still run Mewtwo, but I feel like the tricky part is just that electric energy, like with Welder, fire energy is so easy, but to get that one electric might be a little tricky. But then essentially, it's kind of like um, Blacephalon, only it's 90x, and you discard any number of fire and electric energy, 90x damage for each one. Totally insane damage. And that art is amazing. The alternate art looks even better with like a enlarged N. It's like kind of like in the middle. All right, let's see. We got a fishing rod card. Sneasel. Drillbur, I think. Oh, there's an alternate art of him too. Rolts. Clefairy. Oh, Clefairy. <laughs> Japanese packs is such a different feeling opening these just because like, um, Five cards per pack. It's like a thing I usually associate with Yu-Gi-Oh. And ah, this must be the size of a toad. Quite ugly. <laughs> a Requinid. Type Null. Gloom. And I can never remember your name. But we did pull the alternate art of that one as well. Let's see what else we can get. Raichu, 
Piplup. Ooh, nice! The Gardevoir one. And oh, okay, it's always in the card before. And then we got Roxy for the last one. But this is the Gardevoir. Oh, what is your name? It wasn't Ollie or something like that. I can't remember. But. Oh no, that's Gallade. Is it Gallade? It looks like Gallade more than Gardevoir. But either way, huge fan of that evolution line, whether it's Gallade or Gardevoir, big fan, and I just love these. You know, it doesn't have any texturing, but it's okay just because it is a, technically a common, or alternate art of a common, so I'm fine with that. But I just love this new introduction of these new character rares. I think it's a very cool new thing to move into. And hope they continue to, to do it in the future. We got a Clefairy doll, Natsu, Pikachu, and then the Exadrool, Exadrool I think. Alright, I would say this is a pretty good opening so far. One character rare, one of the new tag teams, and it's the best one. Lily, Slugma, um, Dewpider, Magnemite, and... A Weavile. We did get the alternate art Weavile last in our previous box. Yeah, I think in the previous box, I think there was like eight cards total, like three or four character rares, and um, we did get one of the uh, not um, not a secret rare, but it was SR. <laughs> was the alternate art of the Lily, and then Vile Plume. This is one we pulled last time too. Wouldn't mind getting the alternate art of her. This card's pretty interesting. They've, it does a lot of healing. They can heal 30 from all your Pokemon or something like that. Pretty cool GX. And the Alter Genesis is going to be out soon. I'm not sure if I'm excited about it as this set, but we'll probably get at least one box. Got Rosa. Just to open up for the channel. I think they're introducing like tag team supporters, which I'm not even sure. Napoleon, we got what the um, what it means to have two tag team of supporter. Let's see, Sneasel, then a Weezing. All right, three packs remaining. Good number of hits, but uh, nothing home runish yet. Let's get one more character rare. Oh, I want you. <laughs> That's the one I want. Drillbur. An exit drill again. Alright, two packs remaining. This goes super fast. And uh, if you do enjoy the content, guys, do me a favor, hit that like button. And uh, if you're not already a sub, be sure to hit that subscribe button as well. Curlia. A little puppy. Dupider and... Lawrence or something like that? Or Clay, I think it's Clay. Alright, last pack. See, we only got three hits. And if the sides are distributed equally, I would expect this one to be a good good pack. Let's see what we can get. Roxy. Onyx. Type Null. Net 2. And is this going to be where that card would be? Ah, just another um, Gallade, and... Ah, yes, okay, so this definitely is Gallade, because it's the same exact card here. Oh, I don't remember if this card was any good, but... Um, definitely appreciate that we did get the alternate art one. So, to wrap up our polls, we did get a Vileplume GX. The Gallade with... Oh, I can't remember your name. And... Ooh, this is the one... That's going to be a big deal in the near future. Zekrom, Reshiram, it's going to be super powerful. Um, Alright, so that's going to be it for this opening. And uh, definitely, don't worry, we're going to be continuing with the Hidden Fates for sure. Um, you know, it's like two weeks of Hidden Fates pin collection. It's going to be two weeks of tins and then some period of time of the ETBs. I'm not sure if we're going to do much of those premium collection things. But everything else, we're going to have a bunch of openings for. So if you're not already sub. And you're looking forward to those videos definitely hit that sub button but uh thanks for watching guys as always i'm moana turtle and i'll catch you guys next time